look, we're at a hotel. There's our buddy Dino's car. He's here visiting us for the weekend, or a couple days, I guess it is. And we weekend. are currently taking him to see some of the lighthouses in our area. So we figured since we're taking him to see lighthouses, we should take you guys to see lighthouses, right? Right, it's right. only fair. Right, and it's a beautiful day. So um, sadly, Greg had to work today, so Greg doesn't get to go. But apparently we're gonna go on another adventure tomorrow. We don't know where we're going, but we're gonna go on another adventure tomorrow and Greg will be with us tomorrow. So we're just waiting for him to check into his motel. And I don't know if you guys can hear the sirens. Can you hear the sirens? Walmart over there. <laughs> I don't think I've ever showed you guys this side of town, but here's Best Western. Walmart's over there. That's where our new Meyer building is going, is right back there. Nice. So there, now you've seen a little bit more of Alpina. And there's a Chinese restaurant right there. Jimmy Chen's. We are at 40 Mile Point Lighthouse, and I don't know if it's too windy for you guys to hear me or not. It's pretty windy. Quick before it gets windy, there's the 40 Mile Point Lighthouse. Right over there. On Lake Huron. Which is right over there. I don't know if they can hear me. It's kind of windy. It's very windy. I'm not ringing the bell. Come on, Jamie, ring the bell. What if, maybe Do you it! Ring. Maybe you should ring the You're such a wimp. I rang it louder than you. Yeah. Ring the thing in. <laughs> I'm gonna ring the bell. Ready? I'm gonna do it. Alright, do it. Make Jamie embarrassed. Is that mistletoe? Mistletoe. Maybe. Mm. <laughs> no, I don't think it is. I think it's uh, These are pretty too. Look, we're inside the lighthouse now. This is pretty cool. Oh, that's awesome. It's a big organ. Look at that. That's cool. That's so cool. We've never been in this lighthouse. Every time Jamie and I come here, it's closed. I like that clock too. It's pretty neat. So we were going to climb to the top of 40 mile point, which I've never done. Have you ever done it? Uh, it looks slightly familiar. I don't know. I've never been to the top of this one. No. So, oh, watch me fall up the steps. So we are going to go up these scary steps. Bye, Jamie. Bye. See you later. All right, I'm a little nervous. I can see through the steps. <laughs> Let's go. On the bottom of the base here. We're at the Doing top. 1872. From Paris. From Paris? Yes. At least the metal case. <laughs> <laughs> no, the whole thing. I'm nothing, sure I was just saying, I'm sure the glass. Yeah, Paris. nothing was made like this in the United States, and in fact, yeah, it's, cool. it's been generations since the. And what is poison ivy over there? If you guys remember from last year's fun with poison ivy, I need to stay away from it. But we are walking to a shipwreck that I did not know was here. Oh, here's a pretty yellow flower yellow, pink, whatever color it is. We're walking to a shipwreck. Is this a picture of it? Here's a picture of it. 250 feet. The SS Joseph Fay, built in 1871, wrecked here on October 19th, 1905. I'm gonna see the starboard side on the beach over here. Here's the shipwreck. This is the starboard side of the ship. The rest of it is out there in the water. But here's what's left of it. I hope you guys can hear me trying to block some of the wind. That's pretty cool. Pretty neat. And the rest of the little, the little ones of the undergrads, when they were doing their schoolwork, they weren't listening to the radio or the background music or anything. They were listening to the teacher giving instruction to the lessons to the older kids. So after they heard that same lesson. So that was the Glovey Schoolhouse. Built in the 1880s and it was used as a schoolhouse until 1960 and then they moved it here and turned it into a museum. Pretty neat. We're at Calcite, I almost said Calcite Credit Union. <laughs> no. We're at the Calcite Quarry, which is the largest limestone quarry in the world from what we were told. There it is. And there's the lake. No penis over there somewhere. Somewhere. Grand Lake's over there. Pretty cool. We're at the next destination. We are now at the Presque Lighthouse, which I don't know when the last time we were here was. If you guys get something on you, hold on. This is the Haunted Lighthouse. The old Presque Lighthouse. Um, if you look it up on the internet, you can actually find a lot of information on it. It is haunted. This is pretty cool. The Lighthouse Keeper. 
There's the lighthouse. We're going over there. There's the haunted lighthouse. I told him it was haunted. Because really, it is haunted, I'm telling you. Somebody's ringing the bell. <laughs> I'm gonna do that, just so you know. That's okay. <laughs> There's somebody going on a wave runner. Sure you don't want to buy one of those? Oh. Can take the audience for a ride on a wave runner. Sounds like my arm would hurt. Yeah. And be cold. There's an old map of Michigan from 1839. I think they're missing most of Traverse City right here. <laughs> and I think this comes out a little bit far right here. <laughs> it's pretty neat though. And and that's called Sandy Bay. Right. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Here comes Jamie. We're climbing the haunted Presque Isle Lighthouse. This is the one that says there's a there's no light in here, but people see the light almost daily. Somebody's ringing the bell. It's loud in here. Up and up and up we go. Here we go. Show you out the window. There's out the window. Yeah. We made it to the top of the lighthouse. This is the small lighthouse, but we're definitely high up there. Here I'll show you. <laughs> That funny. We're at the tops of the trees, it's for her. Yeah, we are. See, the lens is there, but there's really no light inside. But every night it lights up. There's the view. All right, so this big bell was taken from the Lansing City Hall clock tower when the building was torn down in 1959. It weighs 3,425 pounds, and it's 60% heavier than the Liberty Bell, and it was made in 1896. Just, Do it! Just as a comparison, this is the bell right here. It weighs more than, about the same as our Jeep. Right? Do it! Yep! <laughs> Can't even stop it. No. <laughs> the audience is now deaf. Look, red Jeep. Red Jeep. See? We made a friend. <laughs> now we are at the new Presque Isle Lighthouse. There's the... Part of the museum and the lighthouse, and I think we're gonna climb this one too. This one is ridiculously taller than the other one, though, so we will see if we do that. So it's like this tall. <laughs> we're gonna go up it because we're crazy. There is the Fresno lens on display. That's just cool. And that's the lens that used to be in the lighthouse to light everything up. Okay, so this is 130 feet, 130 steps up. And apparently, woohoo! I can't even see you. Dino's halfway there. We're going up. We're halfway there. It says so right here. Halfway there. I'm just wondering what up on my hand. There you go. Very tall, very high up, lots of steps. But it'll be worth it when we get to the top. Here, I'll show you guys how cool this looks, ready? Very trippy. And then up. <laughs> we made it to the top. There's Jamie's Jeep. It looks like a matchbox car. <laughs> Everybody wave, we made it, we survived. <laughs> It's a lot farther down than the last one. Look, there's some people. Now you can tell how far down it is. Don't throw pennies at people, it's rude. Yeah, we're <laughs> Don't do that, that's disgusting. <laughs> a little flipped out. Say, I'm staying way over here, but we made it to the top of the lighthouse. Kind of freaky, but we're here. It is a very pretty view on a beautiful day. There it is. This one was built in 1870. And we were just way up there. So we stopped at the little store in Presqu'ile and we are having dinner. I got a sandwich. Surprise, surprise. Right. You get a sandwich too? I got a sandwich you too. You got a sandwich too. Todd got a sandwich too. He's still waiting for his, so we're waiting for him to come out. So we climbed some lighthouses and now we have to replenish all of the. Wow, that bread looks really pretty. Mm -hmm. We have to replenish all of our. Uh, calories or something. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm hungry. I'm going to eat this. 
we're at another lighthouse. We were, we were actually at this lighthouse not long ago with you guys. Um, I don't remember when it was. It was, somebody's ringing the bell, a couple weeks ago. I'm gonna walk back here even though it says caution poison ivy. I'm gonna do it. Really it's not really poison ivy. I'm risking my life. Yes, it is poison ivy. <laughs> I will show it to you. Hold on. I have to find it. Here's the old Bailey schoolhouse from 1907. And the bell is still up there. Yep. Yeah. The bell was in that other schoolhouse we were in. I was going to ask him about the bell. It's in he there. Had the... It was there. It was just in the front he, part of the house. It wasn't he in the. For it? Wasn't it? Yeah, he did. He, he, we could have rang it, but we oh, didn't. Oh, we should have. And there's Sturgeon Point Lighthouse again. Of course, we're not going up in this one because it's closed. Too late in the day. But still pretty cool. It's turning out to be a really pretty night. There's a boat. <laughs> I'm on a boat! I found another bell. <laughs> Hi, Jamie. Nice. <laughs> I bet you can do it a few times really fast, huh? I thought about it, but <laughs> it hurts your ears. I'm standing like directly underneath it. It kind of makes, my ears are ringing. Yeah, the audience is now deaf. The audience is now deaf. Look, this is an Alcona historic site. Pretty cool. I think so. So now we've got all three going off. We've got Mackinac's going off. Let's see if I can find them. St. Ignis is going off. Or Mackinac Island was going off. St. Ignis is going off and Mackinac's going off. So there they are. One there. One way over there. And then the island way over here. That's yeah, pretty cool. Well, the island started theirs. 